In 2006, there was an article in the New York Times that said rye whiskey was going to make a comeback. Genuine Pennsylvania rye whiskey that would make Dad proud. Excellent. Saw the article, chatted about it for a while, and thought it was a joke at the beginning, but after a while, we started taking it seriously, and by 2009, we put together a business plan and raised the money and started up in 2010. There's nothing more important than a high quality package. You have to have it. You gotta get someone to be able to pick that bottle up. And if they're not willing to pick that bottle up, it's gonna sit there for a very long time. We started off looking for manufacturers who would be able to make a bottle to our design. We found Anchor Hawking and they were very interested in working with us. And we especially liked the fact that they were located right in our home state. The significance of us being located in Pennsylvania is due to the fact that Dad's Hat prides themselves in sourcing all of their components from the state of Pennsylvania. Herman sent me a bottle image. This was pre-prohibition. This was kind of the shape that he wanted. We then worked with uh, Signature Communications, who helped tailor that design into a more sculpted look. We talked to bartenders and beverage managers about how our packaging would help launch our brand and getting us better positioning inside their establishments. He had several attributes that uh, he wanted to incorporate into the design. It made the bottle unique. It also made the bottle somewhat difficult to manufacture. But we were up for the challenge. Those shoulders refer to the Pennsylvania Keystone, which is an important part of our brand identity. The physical attributes of the bottle or the dimensions are very critical. And at the same time, we're also maintaining a high aesthetic quality. Through a partnership, we developed from initial image on paper to actual glass bottle today. Greg and the team at Anchor Hawking did a super job in guiding us through the process of developing a design, generating a prototype, and giving us things to look at that we could then appreciate as to whether we liked them or not. This bottle has remained the same since day one production, December 2011.